<laughs> Alright, so I have a piece of choke cherry. Now I I I filmed me cutting this piece off a couple of years ago and I don't know where it went. Uh I'm turning end grain so that the grain's running this way. Uh because I cut this right off where the ants had killed the tree. Uh right now I'm finding a lot of dirt and it's playing playing hell with my tools. Uh and then I'm not sure what these holes are going to be like or whatever. So, I, I'm, not, I'm not even quite sure what I'm going to do yet. <laughs> so, so, as you've seen, I went with the Caster's Choice colors, uh, Blood Red and the Lime Green. Now, I added a little bit of um, my, Micro, Micro Pearl, Micro Pearl from Pearl X into the green and I added some uh, just some black into the red to deepen the color a little bit some micro powder black and, and you can see it here oh you can't really see it here <laughs> so I can see it anyways in here you can see it so it should stand out pretty well I don't even really know what I was going for so I'm thinking uh, uh, the spaceship kind of look to this with a bowl or so anyway, so the rim in, inside, but I've got a, I've got her, I've gotten her kind of round. I mean, I got a little bit here left still, but uh, yeah. So I'm gonna taper this off and then taper that off, and then we'll get to hollowing it. have decided I am not going to fix it. Aside from trying to turn that out, you see it right there, and then there is a crack right here on this side, but I think when I shape it a little bit more, maybe I get rid of it, and I have to get rid of these. <clears throat> I think that's just my OCD, but we'll try it.
no stickers. So anyways, uh, you seen I pointed that Huey's Lionheart YouTube channel, so go over and check him out, and I'll put that in the description below. I already put it up in the corner. Um, and I'll put it at the end. Uh, let's see. We've already done Bruce. We've already done Can Over Moon Pie. A lot of these people aren't even doing videos anymore. <laughs> so, uh, how about we go with Ed over at Wolf Ridge. So we'll put him over there in the corner. Go check out Ed's channel. He does some pretty cool stuff with resin. And, uh, you know, I'm sure he'll appreciate it. If you like what he's doing, hit that subscribe button over there. So. <laughs> um, yeah, I did a lot of sharpening of my tools. I just tried to give you a little bit of it. Even though it was the same one over and over and over again, but that's what I felt like back over there, back over there, back over there. Uh, the ants, I don't know if they bring dirt in or they make concrete when they do this. <laughs> but that's what it is. So, uh, okay, so it's choke cherry. I just cut it off the tree, right? No, it, it isn't this way on the tree, it's this way on the tree. So, and grain that could have been part of my problem also uh, I noticed the last time I turned cherry I had issues with it maybe it's just hard <laughs> and I finished it in lacquer I'm getting lazy actually I'm just trying not to be frustrated because that resin finish really frustrates me uh, I did red and green kind of felt like Christmas <laughs> I just grabbed two contrasting colors uh, and I thought they would look good up against the darker wood. The red's a bit too dark sometimes, but... Uh, and then I, I didn't quite go dark enough with my logo, or light enough with my logo in there. I thought it would stand out better than that. It don't. You can still see it. Uh, I left all the holes in it, which is really... <sighs> driving me crazy because there's holes in it. But, um, yeah, so holes. There's holes through it. There's Yeah. That, and pits and, like... I see the two little spots, one there and one there, where the resin came through. <laughs> I, I like it. It it it's a little thick on the bottom. I think it's heavy. It's kind of hard to tell, and I was worried about going through it. Uh, so <laughs> I did most of it with uh, with traditional tools. It came to a point where I'm like I'm just tired of sharpening it, and I went to and I need to get around the corner anyways in here. So I went to carbide. It got the job done. And then we sprayed it with clear lacquer, like I said. And, uh, yeah. Uh, I don't know what else to say about it. <laughs> uh, I'll put pictures up at the end. Go check everybody out. Um, uh, where is he? Over, 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 over. Oh, yep. Go check out Huey and... Where's Ed? There's Ed right there. It's on the wrong side. It's hard to do this way. This way? Yeah, no. So yeah, uh, pictures at the end. Uh, give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Y'all have a great weekend. And have a happy Father's Day. There's something else I was gonna say too. I don't remember what it was now. Oh, I congratulate Claire over here at Crafty Corners. Miss Claire, right here. 40,000 subscribers, up and coming. <laughs> it's weird how that works, isn't it Claire? Just out of nowhere. It happens. So anyways, uh, if you haven't checked out Claire's channel, I will put her and go, go check her out. Show her some love. <laughs> you guys have a great weekend. Bye.